Hello guys, it's me again, VVV, and welcome to Vietnam. Yes, uh, it will be a big miss if you come to Vietnam without trying street food here. Yes, Vietnamese cuisines always know how to make their diner go from this right to another. Yes, so hey my friends, what are you waiting for? Let's go to Vietnam, let's go to Hanoi, yes! Yes, and I live in Hanoi and I love this city. I love its food, its dynamic busy streets, yeah, its hidden coffee shops. Yes, and I also interested in Hanoi local restaurant, yeah, with low bloody spoons, narrow placement and crowded space. Yes, and when in Hanoi, do as Hanoian do. So do you know what Hanoian do? Okay, let I show you. Hanoians often greet the morning with Vietnam Vietnam signature dishes. Yeah, for example, uh, rice noodle soup, pho, Vietnamese sandwich, bánh mì, or braised thai beef noodle, bún bò Huế. Yes, and I have already have videos talking about that dish. That dishes. Yes, and today I am going to talk about one of the most popular breakfast in Vietnam. Yes and that is soy yes soy yeah soy or you can call it in english uh sticky vietnamese sticky rice or glutinous rice yes. however i think we should call vietnamese dishes by their vietnamese names yeah this way is more friendly homely and more vietnam yeah okay so in this video i will call soy is soy yes and um yeah where to eat soy in hanoi yes hanoi gamas definitely knows about soy missing mate yes there is two intersection selling soy yeah the first one is between hang bai and uh little kia street yeah missing mate son soy there and the second one is between hang bai and vok duc street yeah it is street stone of her daughter Yes, and so Miss May, so Miss May is has uh, is always crowded with people from 6 a.m. to 9 a.m. Yeah, so if you want to enjoy enjoy one of the most popular breakfast in Vietnam, please wake up and come there early. Yeah, if you stay late, you will meet it. Yes, okay. So now, go to so Miss May. Yeah, um, soy is a very special dish for breakfast in Vietnam. Yeah, especially for students and many old laborers because it is cheap. But deal is a, yeah, like the way Obama says about bún chả in Vietnam. Yes, and by the way, bún chả is also a Vietnamese street food. Yes, and uh, uh, yeah, made from sticky rice. Just me, soy will make you full the whole day. Yeah, and you can find soy in uh, from the luxury restaurant to street store like this. Yes, and however, soy is not soy anymore when eating in an air conditioned room with a professional services. After that, soy is still street food, which means that people should buy and enjoy it on the streets. Yes, and now. Yes, we are sitting here and waiting for our soy as Vietnamese today. Yes, I'm so excited. Yes, mm. yes, a uh, soy miss event. Yes, in the intersection sphere between a uh, Duc Street and Hang Bai Street. Yes, and you can see, yes, a uh, whole street store with a few square meter of seats. A sticky rice bag skit and a few, a few shopping bag. Yes, but her street store has been full of customer for nearly 24 years. Yes, and so yes, sticky rice soy so will be placed in a bowl of banana leaf, depending on whether it's eaten here or take, taken away. Yes, when eating soy at stop, 
you will be stuffed with a bowl of soy yes and if taking away yeah you will have soy wrapped in a banana leaf and enjoy it with a small plastic spoon yes and this way seems to be not environmentally friendly yeah but the situation is very common in um, developing countries like Vietnam and I don't like it I do object to this so let's limit your use of plastic as much as possible yes to protect environment okay so now come back with our soy yes and so many events just have two kinds of soy the first one a soy cell yeah yellow sticky rice and the second one is soy ngô soy wheat corn yes and today i have ordered the uh, original soy soy cell eat this one soy cell and my friends he orders yeah soy ngô soy wheat corn oh let me see about yeah so we can yeah you can see corn yeah okay yes and yeah i'm sitting here and uh enjoying and eating soy as well so you can see as i told you so we'll be placed in a bowl like this yes and okay let's see mm. nobody knows where the name soy cell came from and why it has such a well named cell <laughs> yeah, because in Vietnamese cell is you uh, as an impolite way when telling people to go away sell it sell it yes it's very rude yeah impolite but anyways I could say soy cell is an interesting name yeah okay so let me see what we have with soy cell yeah uh soy is made from sticky rice yeah gluten rice yeah and it has yellow color yellow color thanks to turmeric powder yes and yeah other yellow color too is mung bean yeah this one yes mung bean or green bean is a, um, a popular material in vietnamese cuisines yes and it's usually used for cooking vietnamese sweet soup uh, because of its benefits yeah it's a uh, consists of vitamin uh, mirronals and yeah beneficial enzyme which is as a uh, um, excellent part for a healthy diet yes and i have mentioned about vietnamese sweet soup yeah vietnamese sweet soup is a very famous dessert in vietnam yeah it is tea yes and yeah yeah i'm looking for something not yellow color yeah this one yeah this one is fried onion yeah the fatty and creepy feel do not only uh, contrast and thus make one to enjoy the dish non-stop but also adds a new color to the glossy social yes you can see not yellow color yeah this one yes and um yeah to finish a bowl of soy cell uh, the seller will add a, a teaspoon a tablespoon liquid of fresh yes and it will make the soy cell more crazy and if you don't like it please remind the staff yeah i don't like liquids of fresh tôi không thích nước mỡ okay yes and uh, uh, some people uh, like eating soy cell, uh, eating soy with a uh, mung bean or fried onions while others, yeah, especially children, yeah, love to eat soy with a lot of zuok yeah, zuok, eat this one, a lot of zuok yeah, this one, yeah, uh, this one is zuok zuok is meat strings, yeah, in English, yes, and it's made from pork and uh it's not a choice for veg vegetarian yeah but it do not uh bring the misty taste uh, like a traditional uh this is has uh, from uh, pork or chicken yeah the taste is a lighter in flavors and well with soy cell yeah and besides we can eat soy cell with with it's soy with this one 
Vietnamese sausage. Yes, it's uh, also made from pork. Yes, and yeah, in this video, we have a uh, knowledge about many street foods in Vietnam. Yes, the rice, rice, uh, bún chả, Vietnamese street food, chè, and quán cách. Yes, and you can see my videos about that dish in uh, description below. Yeah. Okay, and you can see everything makes a mess perfectly and combined to the an eye cut eye catching so itself, yeah. And yes, um uh all ingredients from mung bean to uh uh, mixed string of fried onions are uh, made from uh, Miss Yvonne family to ensure the best uh, the best taste of soy soy sao or soy ngô yes and yeah a bowl of soy like this with full of topping yeah Vietnamese sauces mixed string yeah like this is 20,000 Vietnam dollars yeah, just one dollar so it's the price is really really reasonable yes you can see most of vietnamese streets is uh want the price is just one dollar so you yeah, don't worry about what when traveling to vietnam don't worry about what to eat yes because every street food is really delicious and the price is very reasonable if you have ten dollar you can eat 10 vietnamese street foods and if you have hummus, you can eat even hummus one. Yes, it's very nice. Okay, and you can enjoy a bowl of soy sauce with a cup of soya milk. Yeah. And yes, I highly recommend. I highly recommend. Uh, you should uh, have breakfast with soy sauce to have full energy for a day with a lot of activities activity yes okay i'm stopping now let's eat with me Okay, so Missy Mai, yeah, in two intersections. The first one is between Hang Bai and Little Kid Street, and the second one is between Bok Duk and Hang Bai Street. Yes, those are, uh, it just takes um, about 500 meters from Hoi Kim Lake. Yes, and a bowl of so with full topping, yeah. Miss strings uh Vietnamese sauce is yes the twenty thousand Vietnam dong yes one dollar okay so now it's my boat mm, yeah it's quite nice the taste okay I vote for it three point five three point five star thanks for watching